Ég er ekki frá borga fyrir þetta. Uh, sorry, I don't speak Icelandic. I'm not paying for that. No, no, of course not. No, okay, what's wrong with you? What? Do you have ten thumbs, you stupid woman? Can't you just wrap up these glasses so I can drink my booze? Fuck you! Hey. Hey. Oh, thanks. How she called me. Are you gonna come back to work? Shift was almost over anyway. I should move back to Leeds. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing here. I'm not drawing any inspiration from this place anymore. I'm just sustaining myself. Come on. It's not too bad. I mean, you make enough money to, to enjoy yourself at least. That's not what I came here to do. I wanted to write and do plays. We're doing the opposite of that. We're selling plastic and, and lies to people who don't know any better. We're part of the problem. Mm. There was this middle-aged guy. He came into the store the other day. He was from Austria, I think, or something. And he kept picking up the puffin dolls and just laugh. He would laugh and laugh, and I thought he was crazy. You know, like a stupid person or a retard. We got chatting at the counter. And he told me that his wife had died of leukemia last year. And he was taking this trip by himself. You know, he'd always wanted to come here. And those fucking puffin dolls. He just cheered him up, you know? And I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Are you making this up? <laughs> yeah. Well, only the wife part. The rest is true. Tak fyrir at vera góðu gaui. Don't you ever butcher my language like that again. <laughs> Come on. Let's go. Maybe I can help you with the inspiration thing. Did you know that only a third of glass bottles are recycled every year? Oh, come on, I have to give it a breath. <sighs>